it's kind of interesting uh, what's happening with the Latin American auctions at, um, at Sotheby's and Christie's. It used to be that uh, both Sotheby's and Christie's had their Latin American auctions in, in May and then uh, the, another auction in November. As of last year, Sotheby's basically uh, started putting all the contemporary Latin American works in their regular international, um, international um, contemporary auction. What's happening, this, what, what's happening now is that all the works uh, by Latin American artists have done away with their, Sotheby's have done away with their Latin American auctions completely and all the works are going directly either into the contemporary auctions, international contemporary auctions or the international um, modern and, and um, impressionist uh, auctions. So this is the first time this has happened and I think it's a really kind of um, exciting move because it, it puts Mexican art and Latin American art on a completely different platform as opposed to being kind of separated out from it's been very kind of much included in what's been happening uh, basically throughout the 20th century and 21st century uh, internationally both in Europe the United States and now Latin America so I feel this is a really kind of important move forward and it's going to be interesting how it affects Latin American art. Um, Chris is on the other hand uh, are maintaining their Latin American auctions so really now we, we'll be down to just um, in Latin auction season which uh, is, is uh, May and then again in November it'll just be uh, Christie's going forward unless uh, Sotheby's uh, for some, some reason decide to kind of change, change it back again but I doubt that that's going to happen. One minute there. Congratulations, one minute it is.